Hey, what's up everybody? Back Opening Addict. We're going to do another really stupid thing today. And we're going to open up a tournament pack of Mirrodin and a tournament pack of Ravnica. Because uh, why not? Why not? Why not? Folks, don't open these kinds of products. Let trained professionals like myself do this. Idiots on the internet who film stuff just because they think it's a hobby or something. And then they really open really dumb packs. Like this, which should stay closed because nothing in here is reserved list, and a lot of the stuff has been reprinted. <clears throat> you know, what, let's start with uh, let's start with Rav actually. Let's let's do that. This was uh, kind of the reason I'm doing this because Mirrodin into Kamigawa into Ravnica for me was <clears throat> after uh, after Urza's block, I, I stopped playing. Pretty much missed a whole lot of it. Got back into it, frankly, at the very tail end of the onslaught, blo uh, onslaught block. Can't even say it was particularly an impressive block. And then Mirrodin came out. And it was a, it was a bit of a wow experience. Artifact deck. Oh my, oh, an artifact set. Oh my god. It was really cool. And then Kamigawa, which I personally really enjoyed. And then Rad, which I think speaks for itself. I think uh, there aren't too many people who... Look down upon Rad Block. It was a really, really good to me. It was a really good three block straight period of time in Magic. So I'm gonna guess that the rares are right after there. It would be my assumption. Yes, I am correct. What is this? It's a Pro Tour card. It's got statistics. Okay, that's that's wonderful. So these are probably rares. So I'm gonna slide those into the back. And it's probably gonna be uncommons on the front. There is. Okay. I'm not going to bother with those. Eh, that's a lot of work. Have to figure out how many there are. Eh. All right. So get your little Rav rules insert because they did add a lot of new stuff in this particular set. And we got for a foil Thundersong Trumpeter. Bunch of lands, bunch of lands, tournament packs. Yep. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Let's get into the meat of this. I wonder if you can get a rare. Anyway, so we got Oath Sworn Giant. Remand. Cool. Cyclopean Snare. Expensive, but that's that's pretty sweet. Conclave Phalanx. Telling Time. Neat. Under City Shade. God, so many memories. Alright, Flash Conscription. Dark Heart of the Wood. Instill Fur. Fur. Whatever. Ivy Dancer. Ivy Dancer. Uh, we got Sky Knight Legionnaire. That's one of the must run cards in uh, the Boros. Peel from Reality. That is a pretty cool common. Seeds of Strength, Galvanic Arc, Celestia Evangel, what am I doing here combining my commons and my uncommons? It's like I'm some kind of, anyway. Fate's Fetters, Compulsive Research, Last Gasp, Night Guard Patrol, Muddle the Mixture. Stinkweed Imp. Spark Mage Apprentice, Fist of Iron Wood, Centaur Safeguard, Tidewater Minion, Gaze of the Gorgon, Goblin Spelunkers, so it wouldn't be a magic set without goblins, Greater Moss Dog, hey, Celestia Sanctuary, that's nice. Stasis Cell. Roofstalker White, the Vaishino Slasher, Golgari Rock Farm, cool. And we got Conclave's Blessing, Quick Change, Sewer Drag, okay, we're getting toward the end of the commons. Seismic Spike, that was always a cool card. I mean, obviously, land destruction, everybody hates it, but still. Hierophant, 
the mirror infiltrator. Okay. So now we should be getting into, nope. Grayscaled, was it Gariel? Just called a crocodile, Jesus. Shred memory. All right, now we should be on to the rares. Loxodon Hierarch. Man. Memories. Loved that card. Doubt it's worth anything, but still. Grows off. <laughs> uh. Light of Sanctions. Nothing particularly spicy, but still. Some neat memories. Neat memories. All right. Mirrored in time. I'm not, uh, I'm never going to do too many vintage openings because, again, it's, it's a really dumb use of money to do this. Like, extremely dumb, even more dumb than I do on my channel already. But, uh, every once in a great while, yeah. All right, we got ourselves a forest. Actually, let me first, because I assume they're built the same. Even though there are some definite spicy uncommons in this particular set. But we got a foil of forest, which is actually pretty sweet and much sweeter than Thunder Song Trumpeter. So then you're going to have a whole bunch of lands, right? Yeah, much lands, much lands, much lands, bunch of Meriden lands. Which I like the Meriden lands. Okay. So let's get to our uncommons first. We're going to get into a Thought Prison. I don't remember that card. Oh, 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 card so good it had to get upshifted, and rightfully so. Isochron Scepter, beautiful. Oh, Sun Droplet. That was such an annoying card back then. I don't even know if it's worth anything or if it's a hit. Scrabbling Claw, but I do remember how much of a pain in the neck it was. Blood Scent, Thirst for Knowledge, first printing. Alters Light. Oh, Talisman of Unity. Totally forgot it. Hey, I see. Yeah, uncommons in this set. Bunch of good ones. Needle Bug. Disarm. So we're on the commons now, okay. So Disarm. Cloud Post. I feel like that's a... I feel like that's a cool common pool. Turn to Dust, Mirror Adapter, Blinding Beam, ooh, Original Seething Song, has been on the list a ton, Frog Might, Pewter Golem, back when Regeneration was still around, Razor Barrier, Soldier Replica, Full Shock Berserker. Malachite Golem. Neurox Spy. Predator Strike. Nim Shrieker. I remember that. Deconstruct. Good old the mirrors. The mirrors. The little mana dork mirrors. And another one. We got the leaded mirror. Terror. Oh, that, that's a card that hasn't been like every single set anymore. Hey, Vault of Whispers. Nice. The artifact land cycle. Goblin War Wagon. Arrest. Wizard Replica. Leonin Elder, Incite War, Yoshin Soldier, <laughs> uh, classic, Wanderer Guard Sentry, Battle Growth, all right, should be coming upon, Dross Scorpion, so probably one more, I think this might be it, Dross Prowler, okay, so now should be the rares. No? Awestrike? Can't really tell how many cards I got in my hand here. Here we go. Volshock Battlemaster for our first rare. 
Yeah. Um, mesmeric Orb. OG Mesmeric Orb. That's pretty sweet. Okay. Come on. One more cool pull. Sculpting Steel. So we got the uh, Double Masters reprints. <laughs> Sculpting Steel and Mesmeric Orb. You know, that's, that's still kind of cool to get the original, original versions. Even if they're not, you know, some of the bigger hits that you can get out of these. That was a that was a fun little video to do. Again, not something I can do very often, or anybody ever should do very often. But every once in a while, I, I might splash some of this in because that was a that was a good trip down memory lane. Um, was Isochron Scepter the best pull? That that mesmeric orb. Interesting. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.